This is your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man Kevin, and today I'm going to show off some of my rare number one issues. Uh, some not so rare, but it's fun. A lot of this stuff is from the um, 90s during the rush to get everything published, and a lot of first issues back then, tons of them. And uh, first off is this book here, Annihilator, American Annihilator. Issue number zero. Now, the fact is, if anybody's heard of this, let me know, because I've looked this up on Google. I've looked this up in price guides. I can't find it. It's like it never existed. The publisher is Dark Realm Publishing. Let's see the logo there. It's from Ontario, Canada. Um, Fred, Diana, Dave Bogle, and Ron Kessman are worked on it. Um, it says dedicated to Jack Kirby, too, which I thought was really kind of cool. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all that I know. American Annihilator. That, there it is. If you know anything about it, you know, leave a comment or send me a message. I'd love to figure out, you know, where this came from exactly, more information about the publisher and the book, find if it's worth anything. Next one is, uh, Crow. Crow number one. Maybe it's Crow dead time number one. Wildcats Trilogy. Build com build comic. The Mighty Mites. That's a X Men. X Men. Uh, X Men. Uh, not spin off, but a, X Men. A spoof on the X Men. And this is published by. Eternity Comics. Uh, Elfquest spinoff right here. This is Elfquest Metamorphosis. Elfquest Wave Dancers. Robotech Neck Angel. Stripe. Files. This is just a, a, like a source book with different characters and stuff from the X-Men series and what Strife's thoughts on them. Punisher 2099, the future of shooting people. Fantastic Force. And a lot of uh, shiny on this cover. Ooh, really shiny. You like shiny, right? Yeah, I love shiny. Warrior Nun. Ariella. I don't have the first issue of the Warrior Nun Ariella, but I have a bunch of them. And Razor. Oh, Shy. Here we go. So this is actually issue one and one through four in a uh, book. I love this cover. This is a really cool cover. Then we got Death's Head and Die Cut. Number one. Another Marvel, you know, series launched in the pre-crash era, and then, you know, then published again. The good guys. Cable. I believe that this is a. Um, <laughs> so for Sable, and then one of my favorite uh, Spider-Man comic characters, got their own series. Star Jammers is one of my favorites because uh, this is the superhero group that Havoc and Cyclops' his dad's a member of. Uh, a Wildcat source book. This is not a comic, right? This is a comic. It's Mr. X. X. Oh, it's Spider-Man! 
this Agents of Change and Star book here. Look. That one. Cyber Zone. Number one. B. Torek the Dinosaur Hunter. Now, how many have uh, played this on the Nintendo 64? Classic. Uh, first person shooter. Um, around shooting dinosaurs. Well, here, here's the comic for it. And last is this Hellstorm number one. And there you go. Some more uh, comics to look at. I hope to get some more uh, posted. I just don't want to go in and just take pictures of comic books. I want to kind of look at different types and stuff. Well, thank you for watching.